have a robot. Oh, fuck. Where's the robot? Do, can I use the robot in here? Does the robot come in here? No. The robot does not come in here. Oh, I broke it a little bit. I broke the graphics a bit. I'm oh, sorry. The robot won't go there. Alright, let's go this way, robot. Robot. Come, robot. I shall call you Samson the robot. Hey, where'd Samson go? Oh man, Samson, what do you do? What's your purpose in life? Why do I have you? The robot won't enter. Oh, will he go in there though? So the robot will go into... Unable to ascend stairs, brilliant. Can you go in there? Oh, you can. Right, right, got it. Right, then we go in. The robot... The robot is here. The robot can attack the police officer. No. The robot can go in the queue. The robot can go in the queue. The, the robot goes in the queue, Bertram. Or the robot goes through there? No. Does that say treasure? D no. Treacle. The robot does the treacle. And onto the police officer. And then he can't do anything. Then we can run through and just... Uh, Illegally ride a train. No, sir, you're right just there. compounding the issue, Bertram. They think you're a murderer. What kind of man are you? Extendo man. Oh dear, he fell over. I've been caked in treacle. I can't see. Blind. That is an unfortunate pose for Bertram. How they getting this look so mean? He's not mean. Police officers isn't nice, but Molasting. now we can sneak surreptitiously by. Anyway. Sir. Quick indeed. Let's go. Quick Onto the train. On the train. Indeed. Are you on? Let's stop. Wretchedly home. Hey, how come they were chasing us? How did you figure that out, Sherlock, you douche? Right, we are in wretchedly place. Where's a lady? Are, Gavin. Wretchedly. It's miles from anywhere. No one will find us now. It's wretchedly. We should make AKA everywhere outside of London. Lump potatoes. A timetable. Gavin, a lady. Let's talk to the lady. Uh, excuse me, dusty old lady. Oh, that's quite the way to introduce yourself, London. isn't it? She's Looks right. like she's been waiting for quite some time. Oh, she's got cobwebs on her. Well, that's unfortunate, isn't it? Timetable. Hmm, there doesn't seem to be any trains back to London forever. Huh. It's Come closed. Oh, right. It's rather dejected. Right, so we go this way. Very slowly, though. What a we delightful are, oh, village. A village, the slaughtered lamb. Gavin. Oh, oh my. That's not good. Lamb. I hope they serve tea. Ooh, I could go for a cider actually. There's a well. Well, well, well. Really, really, Bertram. I mean, if you can, you can at least come up with a pun rather than saying the thing over and over. Who's this old lady? Good day, madam. Could you tell me how to get to Ridgely Hall? You need to cross the swamp of sadfulness. Um. Take care. There are strange things lurking out there. Oh, I'm sure I'll be perfectly fine. I used to be an adventurer. No one who comes up to the house is seen again. They say things have been coming out of the ground. Big things. Unnatural things. That's what she said. Lose your way. I will do my best, old crone. As a donkey. Horse oh thing. My. Oh, it's a pony. Oh, somehow. Oh. oh. Ew, it's all slimy. It's a slimy pony. What a curiously doleful beast. You got a lot to say today, Bertram. Pony. Or bug blooder, as we a call po them. a bog so plodder. I can't even say that. Mud trudger. Mud trudger, that's better. Looks like it is pine. I can say mud trudger. They love frolicking in the swamp. Can cross it with their eyes closed. I'd, I'd rather they just kept their eyes open, though. I will be using you to cross the swamp. 
Child, what are you doing? Ah, uh, Gavin, look at this ruddy-cheeked young country gent. What's wrong with your nose? What's, What's wrong with yours? You young, sir? little shit. Little Waxsmith, the blacksmith's son. What is it that you are doing? Playing Kiki Muck. There's not much to do outside of London, to be honest. What's this? A neglected Has that kid? got horse poo in it? This could still be a barrel of laughs. Are you going to pick something? No, we're not going to pick anything up from there. Some bellows. They they heat the fern the fernas. These bellows aren't going very fast. It's no wonder the furnace is There's cold. no wind, that's why. What a rickety windmill. It looks like it could snap at any moment. Do we need to fix it's this not fellow's windmill? Enough to power the bellows. A good shake and it would fall to pieces. Right. So, how do I do that? Nothing to say about the coals, apparently. The melting bit, where things get melted. Right, that, well, that makes sense, I suppose. I've, I've bugged that out now. So I talk to this man. Good day, sir. I'm looking for Wretchedly Hall. Wretchedly Hall, you say? I do You're say. Third one this week. Lord Am Wretchedly I now? Must be very popular. As long as we keep Suspicious. ourselves to ourselves, he don't bother us. Little Waxsmith, stop being so idle. Right. Right. Into the pub, Bertram. For what, whatever kind of pub you can actually claim this to be. Hey, it's very I recognise you. May we come in? Spotted Dick and Pear Broth are the specials. Mm, hey. You seem familiar. You? What on earth are you doing here? I am an entirely innocent traveller, just out explorating the countryside. Indeed, innocent. I can't talk now. Someone may see. I've left you a message in the toilet. Oh, Bertram, don't don't follow through on that message. It's not what you think. It, it'll, it oh dear. If anyone goes to a bathroom and sees a message written on the wall, don't call that number. Or Unless that's what you're actually the only perpetrator there for. If you don't need a number one or a number twosie, and you're just there to be like, I'm going to go to a public gents and find some bathrooms. Or ladies, for ladies out there. I'm going to go to public, public, public facilities and call the number on the wall. I advise you to not do that. Um, you're probably either going to get um, robbed or have some kind of strange sexual awakening and never turn back and 15 years later you turn up on your home doorstep begging for money because you were addicted to crack and ran and lost like three businesses all selling sexual favours or something like that anyway who's this fellow oh he has a face like an angry satchel the name's doug I'm a bounty hunter. Oh, we got an American. Nothing good about me. Ooh, bounty hunting. That sounds nice. I travel the world, hunting down things. There's something that can't be good. on those moors, and I'm going to be the one to catch it. Knock yourself out, man. Knock yourself out. What's over here? Who we got? We got a bar. We got a barman. Mr. Barman. Ah, good evening, barkeep. Not more strangers. Oh, I like his I mug thing. Tankard doodad. My drinks and buy my food. What's wrong with that? He doesn't like people drinking his drinks or buying his food, even though that's literally the business model of this place. This oh. tin cup makes the ale taste funny. That's not the cup's fault. It's the ale's fault? Hello, sir. I like your hat. Edwin it's very nice, Peter actually. Hunter, vampire Slayer, etc. Quite a resume. Oh. What brings you to these parts? Like a Have Belmont. Have you heard of the thing that haunts the malls? No? No. Well, I intend to kill it anyway. A lot of people here for that. Can I have some cheese? I am used to the finer things in life, and I would hardly describe mouldy cheese as fine. Take really? Mouldy cheese is lovely. I'll have some of that. Mm, Damn. Mouldy cheese, mold mold cheese. I love mouldy cheese. What are you doing now? Oh, he's sharpening his uh, steak for the vampire Roonies. Let's go to the bathroom. Oh, Bertram, just don't I'm do just anything. To the laboratory, Gavin. Shan't be long. Don't shout it across the room. You could literally say it when you were next to him. What have we got in here? We've got a toilet. Oh, that looks hygienic. A some the stuff. The is smeared with something. Well, let's clean that off. One should always wash your hands when you go to the toilet. What's it smeared the with now? Is smeared with something. Yeah, well, it, oh dear, what have I done? 
Um, should I turn that the off water now? Is very hot. It's starting to steam it up is, the yes. What's been revealed on the, the mirror? The mirror is smeared with something. Nothing, apparently. Use the cheese on the mirror. What do you do? Good. <laughs> Scooter, actually, not Gowda, I'm pretty sure. Um, I can't flush the toilet, but I can look in it. Which is obviously the first thing is you do when you message? go to the toilet. It's a rather large message. Oh dear. Ooh, oh, I see! Here. That was letting the air out. The steam out, not the air. One should always wash your hands Let the when air out. What's wrong with me? Right, meet me <gasps> under a poo. <gasps> Secret message. Meet me under the apple tree. Oh dear. That can't be good. Well, I suppose we're doing that. Is that a condom machine? An old Victorian condom machine. That mysterious <gasps> stranger has gone. They have indeed, Bertram. Good point. Well noticed as well. A tiny bucket. We shall have that tiny bucket. The bottom. If you put anything in this broken pail, it would just run away. Well, okay. Thank you for all the rather excessive, um, what's it called? Ex not extrapolation. You know what I mean. You know what, you know what I'm saying. Expo not exponent either. Other words. Can I, uh, use the bucket with the well? Oh, bucket. That won't work. Why not? Can I use that with the well? Surely there's a better way to use this. I can't think of one. Cheese down the Can well. No. Um, can I use cheese with the that? It's unbelievable. Ha <laughs> ha! That was a good one. Uh, a that, no. Can I use the? Oh, for Christ's sake, Bertram, get back oh, over there. Bucket. Bugger. Right. Well, we'll just brute force it later. First, we have a whole other avenue to explore, Bertram. What's out here? Oh. Wretchedly Hall, Wretchedly Village, which is where we were, I guess. The train station's that way. How do I get back to the train station from here? Oh, oh, the apple tree! I found it. Bog apple tree. The fruit, like most things there's a the there's a board in it. Bitter and untrustworthy. And some other shit. But there's also the person. Can I have a the board? Tree house. Oh, is that what that is? Would have been if only they had planned it better. It's all falling to pieces. Hmm. Well, let's talk to you, shall we? What have you got to say for yourself? Over here. What's the Silhouetted person. This? Who are you, sir? It's me, Emelina. I? Oh my! Oh my word! Emelina? I was not what expecting that. Here? And why are you in that's the quite skies? the shocker. I'm currently investigating some mysterious happenings on the moors, but that's not important right now. More I suppose it wouldn't be. What are you doing out here in the countryside, Bertram? Oh, Emelina! I got arrested for a murder. Uh, that's what I was about to say. Oh, yes, Me and Bertram are just on the same level, that. man. It wasn't you. Was it Bertram? It certainly was not, Emelina. How could you think such a thing? Because she's a reporter. I to ask. Sometimes people do some crazy things for love. It was what? was that? Nothing. Tell me exactly what happened. Well, the day started huh. much oh, like any something other. Something sinister going on there. Is she in love with bit. Bertram? Oh, pardon me. And as I was leaving Mrs. Dalsworth's house, I saw Jeff the murderer standing over the body of a flower seller. Hmm. Before I had time to react, he ran off and leapt somewhat incredulously over an impossibly high wall. Then I know this. Why are you telling me? me. I Exposition. I That's the word I was thinking of. Exposition. Expositing. It may have looked slightly suspicious. But it wasn't me, Emelina. I promise. Hmm. Near the Dullsworth estate, you say? I'm Maybe. sure Mrs. Dullsworth would have caught it all on her cameras. But why hasn't she told anyone? We need to prove your innocence. That's yes, what I said. Nice. Maybe I can hack into her CCTV system remotely. This is Victorian England. What? Oh, right. I see. Clever. Oh, I can get Fly, that board now. Daniel. Fly. What exactly is the pigeon going to do? Hold on one moment. I don't know if you're aware, but the way pigeons experience time, a normal film is just like a slideshow to them. Do we just wait for the pigeon to come back now? Ah, oh, here it comes now. That was quick. Is it the same pigeon? It is. How did he get a classified stamp as well? Look, Bertram, photographs of the murdering. And Excellent. Here's one of you and Jeff. It wasn't you at all, Bertram. Here oh, we've got proof. proof Excellent. Well, that's no good, isn't it? Well, we're now. done. Oh, Emily, we're done. How can I ever repay 
innocence proved. To London as soon as you can to clear your name. There's no um. You can catch there's no trains though. Jeff, the murderer yourself. I would love to come with you, but I have some unfinished business here to attend to. I'll tell you all about it one day. Mind how you go. There are some strange goings on out here on the moors, and watch out for Lord Yeah, there would be. There's not much else to do. That's the problem. Stories about him. Oh, oh, can I have your outfit? Can I disguise again? You're just running off into the bog. Can I have your hat? Can I have your coat? So long, Mr. Fiddle. I no is the answer to that. I can have neither your hat nor your coat. We shall take this. A forsaken plank. Never let good wood go to waste, eh? And luckily, it just fits in my pocket. That's what I always say. If you find a piece of wood, you best rub it. Oh, look! A peddling device stuck in the mud. I wonder where that came from. I a can't what device? It. That peddling machine is stuck deep. It will take a lot of effort to get it out. It will. You mean we need a sheep? No, this is not a swamp plank. We found it in the swamp, therefore it is a swamp plank. Bucket? Oh, bucket. That won't work. Ah, An inconsequential see. rock formation. Are you sure about that, Bertram? I don't agree. I think it's consequential. Quite consequential, actually. Oh, right. Oh, I can go this way to get into the swamp. That's good to know. Shortcuts. I do enjoy a good shortcut. Right. I can't go that way, but I can go this way. Back into the... Back into the swamp we go, Bertram, my friend, my friend Hall. What's over here? There is a cave with no one there. Oh, what's that over there? It's a small trollman. Hey, it's a big trollman. Oh my word, he's huge. Hello, mate. Help Paul Magwidge out, would you? I seem to be all tangled up in all these old manacles and I can't seem to get them off. That is unfortunate, isn't it? How do I do that? An escaped convict. That's very perceptive of you. But I'm not a bad man. I was arrested for stealing a loaf of bread to feed me family. That ain't such a crime, is it? Admittedly, I did stuff the baker in a barrel and push him down the hill. But it was in a fit of anger. And I truly regret it now. And by um, the judge, that was a mistake too. Um, I'm a reformed character now. If you help me out of these rusty old manacles, I'll help you across the swamp. Oh, I'll really? Across the swamp without my help. Uh, how would these help you? Oh, bucket. They're... Would cheese help you? I'm hungry, but I'm not desperate. I'm what? hungry. Shut up. Would this mug Surely help? There's a better way to you. Would you like a plank of wood? Careful there. That mm. plank could cause a mishap. No, he doesn't want to plank. Right, so let's find some other. I clicked off the screen. My bad. 